Hello everybody, this is Arlie Lehigh bringing you a commentary on Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Doing some dome right here. This is a really, really, really old gameplay I had on my computer. Um, it's semi beastly. It's not that. It's definitely not the best dome play out there, but it's it's good nonetheless. Um, I it is like two o'clock in the morning right now, and it was a double XP weekend, and I have started a clan, and. We did fairly well for the first TDM that we could do with only having three people do it. Uh, we got in the top 25%, and if you, the main people that we have in the clan, it's a mostly 2KDR clan. There's only two people that we have in it so far that are under a 2KDR. So if any of you guys are watching this and you have a 2KDR, feel free to send me a message and. Uh, uh, 2KDR, 2 and loss, whatever you go for. Um, feel free to send me a message and see if you'd be interested in joining. I mean, my gamer tag's the same as it was in this video, even though I got this gameplay like, I don't know, four months ago. <laughs> like, this game has been on my hard drive for a very long time. Just trying to wait for a good reason to upload it, and this seemed like a good enough reason. So, I know I promised you guys a gameplay earlier in the week, and right here I get greedy and should have shot the guy closest to me, but I'm an idiot. Um, <laughs> anyway, I know I promised you guys a gameplay earlier this week, and I'm sorry that it took me this long. I was just enjoying the double XP weekend and getting my uh, prestiging up. Getting, wow, getting my prestiging up. Let's just ignore the fact that I said that. I was prestiging, and I finally hit 12th prestige, and I only have eight more to go, and I should be there in around, like, August, so by then, I should be able to, sometime in August, by then I should be able to get gameplays out more regularly, because I won't care about what guns I'm using for challenges and stuff, and start using Assault, and do all that fun stuff again, and maybe I'll see if I can find a couple more 2v2 or 3v3 gameplays for you guys, if you guys want to see those, since you guys seem to... Be receptive to the last one, and uh, I don't know why I didn't shoot that guy sooner. Apparently, I didn't feel like it. Um, but yeah, if uh, you guys want to see more 2v2, kill confirm, domination, what we do when we do our clan ops, if any of you guys want to have your clan go against mine, I mean, whatever. Any of it works. Uh, just feel free to send me a message or leave me a comment saying what you want to see. Right here is my favorite move, always shooting a car that's on fire to get the easy kill. Um, fast forward through the Reaper here. I don't think I get more than five kills with this Reaper. I could be wrong. I honestly don't remember. It's been so long since I watched this. I didn't even really watch it when I was fast forwarding. I was texting most of the time. And uh, an another thing about this video is I want you guys to tell me if you did or did not like the color correction in my last video that I did. Um, if, if you guys did like it, then let me know and I'll spend the time doing the color correction on it. If not, then I'll just leave it as is. And your supposed MW3 news is everybody's been getting a terminal glitch showing that a player in their party does not have the map terminal. Apparently, that map will be released later this month, June 2012, uh, to, I don't know, just bring back an old map that people will really want to play. And quite frankly, I'm hoping that they bring it back and don't mess with the colors too much, because that was one of the best things about that map was the coloring that they had done on MW2. And the way it looked was just above all other for any of the maps that they had and I hope that they don't uh, decide to try and tweak that to make it better like they had done with Overgrown in MW2 and decided to darken it up a good bit and brighten it up in other places and places it really shouldn't have been brightened like uh, corners where you're enclosed with a building guess what it's a building you should not have light there but uh, <laughs> completely off topic I think there's like two minutes left in this video and I know I've just like thrown a lot of stuff at you guys question wise but 
if you guys wouldn't mind even answering just one of the questions that I uh, asked, that would be greatly appreciated. Um, I have been trying to get more gameplay. It's just I've been going for the win a little bit more than normal, and I haven't really been uh, taking a passive-aggressive role. I've just been all out running to the spawn, get four or five kills, and get my predator type. So I hope you guys enjoy watching this or if you guys rather see would you rather see a blowout win or a blowout KDR? I mean honestly I'm I can try to get either for you. Again, I know I'm asking a lot of questions, but if you guys want to uh have any input on it, that's 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 why I ask you guys is to get, get to get your input on it. And I really would like to know for the future so I'm putting content out that you guys want to watch. I mean that's one of the whole reasons I'm doing this right is to get stuff out to you guys that you guys want to watch. So if you'd want to go through and answer any of the thousands of questions I just gave you, <laughs> you can feel more than free to do so. Um, but I think this is the end of the game right here, I think. I don't know why I threw a flash at him when he was not moving. I think I might have been going for a challenge. I'm not sure. But, anyway, the final score of this game was 59 and 4, I believe. A pretty beastly score. Nothing uber special, though, but as you can see, that I was 4th prestige when I got this, and I just hit 12th now, so you, you can tell how old this is. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. It has been R. Lehigh bringing you another commentary.